start up and the motor run with that comforting steady first thing in the morning sound just like always I had him come back into the house just like always and it was spring and not yet light so I saw his silhouette in the doorway as he stepped into my room and kissed me on the forehead bye bye honey he said he smelled like soap and old spice and <laughs> a little bit like coffee. I heard his lunch pail clank as he picked it up off the kitchen table and his heavy footsteps as he crossed the living room and out the front door. And I heard him drive off, just like always. Later, when all the people were at the house and at the church, and at the graveyard, what everyone always said was, I was lucky to have had him at all, that he was a great and fine man. But the one that always stuck with me was that God needed an engineer in heaven. God needed an engineer to design heaven for the rest of us because it had gotten all old and falling apart. And God needed the best that there was. So, of course, he called Daddy. Well, now I'm gray with stumbling down dusty roads up rocky shores, seeking that motor and kiss and the soap and the coffee and the sound of the door, that once, that was always. And when I get there, I will lay my cheek in his hands and close my eyes. And he'll say, good night, honey. And it will be, always.